Operation Guide for Geodex G60 Pro RTK GNSS. How to set up the base station. Adjust the circular bubble to be leveled in the center inside the black circle. Connect the data controller with the G60 Pro receiver via Bluetooth. Launch the Geodex RTK Field Software X survey. Go to the second option, page device, communication. Configure the model type as RTK, connection type as Bluetooth. Update and searching the Bluetooth device list. Select the series number of the G60 Pro receiver which you set up as base station. Click button connect on the bottom to get connected. After get connected with the G60 Pro receiver, go to base base mode settings with radio work mode. Select data link. Here we select internal radio. Check channel frequency and the protocol. Choose any of a channel from 0 to 15. Remember to set the same channel number same frequency and the same protocol of the base station on the rover work mode settings then click button ok to confirm the settings confirm the settings are all right click the button set base startup on the right bottom to set up the base station how to set up the rover station How to connect to the rover station? Disconnect the Bluetooth with the base receiver. Update and searching the Bluetooth device list. Select the series number of the G60 Pro receiver which you set up as rover station. Click button connect on the bottom to get connected. Then go to rover rover mode settings. Select data link. Here we select internal radio. Select the same channel number, same frequency and same protocol for the rover station as the base station which we have just set up. Click button apply on the bottom to get fixed solution. We can see fixed on the left top. How to set up rover with internet work mode. Data link select internet. Here we select phone internet. Then select Connect Mode Trip. Receiving data and apply. Coordinate systems and the parameter settings. Various coordinate systems available in the template list for all over the world. Click details to see more information. Apply and complete the settings. Set antenna height. Rocking back and forth completes initialization.
how to site calibration. Go with rover station to do site calibration above one to three control points. Then check the data accuracy between the GPS collecting measurements and the known coordinates of the control points. If the error is within 2 to 3 cm, we can start to do the survey job now. If error is too big, need to check the coordinates and parameters settings, and also the site calibration again.